It is the channel that you come to when you jump on YouTube. Wendy Williams comes for NBA Youngboy. And now, <laughs> let's just say Boosie and NBA Youngboy Mama. They wasn't going for it. It's your favorite local, especially after I spoke. Support the real, get rid of the fake, the F you to the industry. How you fight back is simple. All you got to do is just subscribe and follow me on Instagram at C E D D Y N A S H, one word. Seti Nash, I'm going to follow you back like your pictures and all that. What up with the visionaries? <sighs> I will admit this, right? Wendy actually had a point until the end. What do I mean? I'm going to tell you exactly what she said. She said he's got to go to jail. She's talking about him getting arrested. How do you do a hot pursuit? There are innocent people out here. You could have hurt innocent people in your hot pursuit and running through people's backyards. Nobody wants that. Bringing down property values. And how do you do that? What? How is it that you do what you do with seven kids at only 21 years old? What the hell is they saying? And how is it that you do what you do with seven kids at 21 years old? I don't know what the hell that's supposed to mean, but all right. She had a point, bro. A lot of these cats don't realize, bro, when you take the police on one, you can hurt somebody. And I've seen firsthand somebody's car get hit from somebody running away from the police in the car. They smashed in the back of their car and really messed that person up. So I agree with that. I absolutely agree with that. I don't care. If anybody get mad at me for saying that she was right for that specific sentence, then it's F you. Then on top of that, yeah, if you run in somebody's backyard, bro, you don't understand the PTSD you may have given that person whose house that is. That part is true. But you miss me when you talk about you could have brought down property value. Wendy, you know, if you put your face, like your face, with some pictures and all that with your family, you know that's going to bring down the property value too, by the way. You you do know that. Okay, cool. I, I just want you to know that. If you put your... Be nice, be nice, be nice. You put your face and say you got a black man that you rock with and stuff like that, and you try to sell your home, that brings down the property value, by the way. They absolutely know that part. So I don't know what the hell that was all about. Maybe you're trying to cater to some people that you're trying to get checks from, but you can cut that shit out. And then him having seven kids don't matter. The, the youngin' is a millionaire. So, right there, all in all, what the hell are you talking about? If Cuz was broke, running around from the police and everything like that, that's on them women to find out too. So, let's just understand, you ain't talking to somebody that's broke. That young and probably got more money than you, probably. I have no idea, I'm not checking, I'm not pocket checking your finances, but I think I do know is the NBA young boy is a millionaire. But let's get into what that what that what NBA young boy mama said. She said F Wendy Williams around here letting a half dead ninety year old man Oh S her D. Worried about my child. Stop tagging me and BS she wrote. Then on top of that, you know Boosie gonna try, man. Boosie like free the goat till we see the goat. And then he said, Stop it, Wendy. You did a hot 21 kilos of some yammer before your 21st birthday, all the way to your amazing tumble. Y'all don't remember what he talking about when she was dressed like the Statue of Liberty, but from, you know, the corner bodega trying to sell you insurance. And she, oh, oh, yeah, yeah, we remember that, Wendy. We know you be sneaking and geeking around here. Yeah, we seen you. We sent you back in the day. We got to understand something. As far as one of the biggest trolls of the rap industry, Wendy Williams is the biggest. Let's 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 overstate that. The biggest troll in rap history will forever be Wendy Williams. You run around talking about getting back though by Met the Man, sleeping with Big Daddy Kane and all of this and everything and how cats was all over you and all that and I'm just like how but, you know, if I get one more drink, I'm going to... I still couldn't do it. I ain't going to cap. Like, I, I can't. I couldn't do it. But, you know, 90s, y'all used to do some crazy, wild, exotic drugs. Y'all smoked Sherm and stuff like that. So you possibly could have looked like Stacey Dash. <laughs> Let 
Man, y'all expect me to keep it real because you know that I will. I do this daily, baby. Make sure you check out the Nightly Nash podcast and stream the music. Check out the video, by the way. And, uh, yeah, if you haven't subscribed, why the hell not? You haven't followed me on Instagram for your follower and hella likes and asks, why the hell not? Honestly. Play dumb. That's a definite. Ah! His intelligence is new cats is delicate. Damn. You don't know the same. Damn. You want to lose and learn how to win. That's a 